so you wake up with these every morning or these are my friday shoes i wear these on fridays what do you wear monday through thursday oh you don't want to see i'm so fancy you already know i'm in the fast lane yeah so i personally those excuse me one second okay hello i don't work on fridays you know that i'm sorry I've been really liking iced coffee in the morning. But I'm gonna be drinking Stoke. This is black coffee. I don't know about you, but I'm not one of those people that can drink like just black coffee. I'm not that mature. I'm using this one from, is this from Trader Joe's? I think so. It's just French vanilla. Cause I'm fancy like this. It's like, it's like we're at a cafe. So along with my breakfast every morning, I've been taking my vitamins from Care Of. You take this like five minute quiz online and they ask you um, what are your health concerns, what's your lifestyle like. So my biggest thing is I said I wanted stronger hair, I wanted more energy, um, all sorts of things. And then they send you a personalized packet of vitamins like so. And then it has your name on the front of it with a little quote or today's fact. It says, there's a theory that people with blue eyes have a higher tolerance for alcohol. It's just a theory though. So this is the box that it comes in. It comes with like 30 packets in one box. I have a promo code for y'all. So if you use the promo code Danny, you get 25% off. So I'll put the link down below if y'all want to check it out. But I'm serious. I feel like this is going to help me a lot. The only thing is it takes me a while to like take all the pills. And one of them really makes my pee super yellow. Is that TMI? Okay, maybe cut that. I'm gonna keep it. <laughs> what do you eat for breakfast every morning? Okay guys, I'm gonna start with making oatmeal this morning. So I usually go for purely Elizabeth's oatmeal. The different flavors have different colors. How cute! Uh, blueberry lemon and coconut turmeric. This is raspberry, which is what I'm gonna be making, honestly, because it's pink and it's the cutest. And then I'm gonna add some bananas in there because I like bananas. Bananas and barbecue sauce. Not together, just those two, two bees. I love them all. Best thing about this breakfast is that it's super easy to make. The water to the line, and then you put it in the microwave for 60 seconds. And that is my kind of breakfast. It's real fast. That was, that was a bad joke. Fill the water to the line. Hmm. Do you see the line? Maybe just to like, when in doubt, microwave it out. No one says that. Yes, they do. It's not a thing. Yes, they do. One time I put pasta in the microwave and I forgot to put water and it actually caught on fire. Oh, that's great. I got in so much trouble. By who? My mom. I feel like I messed this up. Uh, really? Oh, there was the fill line. Oh. I definitely messed that up. It's okay. I'm not perfect. I never said I was. I'm usually perfect on Mondays though. Oh, it's just an off day. <laughs> so let's just put it to the fill line, shall I we? I don't think anyone has ever made a meal with a strainer. <laughs> oh man. Let's just go ahead and say that the product is good. So next up, I'm just gonna pour this bad boy in there. And then it comes with a little granola pack. You know, I've never had oatmeal before. What? Jordan, fun fact, will eat like probably 10 clementines in one sitting. Okay, so this is my breakfast. Super easy. I love oatmeal before I go run, but I have to wait like 30 minutes because you don't want to be like on the trail. That's yeah. rude. And then I have my coffee. Whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, uh, uh. Okay. Oh, the one thing I do want to show y'all that is so cool like if you make yourself coffee in the morning this is a mug by mighty mug watch this look you can hit it as hard as you look i'm hitting it hard watch this watch welcome to my second home always take the free food why did the banana go to the doctor it wasn't peeling very well <laughs> what happens to grapes when you step on them they whine they what? They whine. Hey, why did the orange stop? It ran out of juice. All right, let's go get some lunch. <laughs> I think I might need this. Danny, we're here for lunch. Mm. I like how it actually folds over all the way. I need this. 
They're 35% off. Probably because we're at Whole Foods and you're buying a journal. Oh. This is definitely coming home with mama. No, Danny, come on. Let's go a little healthy today. Come on. Come on. Come on. No. Come on. For lunch, I actually usually go for a salad. I like to have two really healthy meals, like for breakfast and for lunch. And then for dinner, I kind of give myself a little bit more freedom. Salads could actually be a lot of fun. They can get very interesting real fast. Hmm. Vegetables. These are garbanzo beans. I really like them because they have a lot of protein in them. They look like Captain Toast Crunch. More protein. This is eggs. You never eat eggs when I make them for you. Because you leave all the shells in there. <laughs> you do balsamic um, dressing on the side. Because if I have leftovers, I don't want it to be all soggy. This is not the healthiest thing in the world, but it is my favorite. It's the honey roasted peanut butter stuff. It tastes so good. It's like this dessert. You gotta tell it to stop. Shoot, shoot, big. Go get help. It's a lot of peanut butter. It's a lot of stomach. Okay, so it looks like we got lunch and more. So it's three o'clock, and that typically means that I get hangry. I usually get so hungry around three o'clock, and I just like hate three o'clock. You get that lull. And you're just like, oh, it's not dinner time yet, but I'm hungry. I will usually have apple and peanut butter for a snack. Can I have some of that? Duh. We're only like married. I don't know, I like to do it like this because then I like to spread the peanut butter. Oh, where's my peanut butter spreader? Oh, that's what that thing is. Did you lose it? No, I just put it in the dishwasher. Remember that thing cut my like finger wide open? Ew, that makes me want to puke a little bit. I know, I'm sorry. Honestly, this, this is good because I have like a huge sweet tooth. If you have a sweet tooth, I like something sweet with a little something salty. I will sprinkle a couple of like almonds on top. Actually, I'll usually go like this. Just do, do, do. I know, I go a little cuckoo. I go hard in the paint, that's for sure. And then, oh, I do want to show you all these. I bought these because like sometimes I just do not feel like eating fruit. Laura's Wholesome Junk Food Oatmeal Chocolate Chip Bite. Biteless. Baking my original recipe since 1993. It's like when I was born. Yeah. Laura, you did it again. Oh my <laughs> gosh. Since 1993. <laughs> yeah, babe, it tastes like the 90s. <laughs> So we just want to note for the record that I do cook for Danny quite a bit. Honestly, you can cook all of the camera. You want me to? I like hate cooking. Oh my gosh, I love it. Give it a Wait, here, take the camera. Welcome to Cooking with In the Crab Girls Trials. <clears throat> cooking with Jordan. Tonight what we're gonna make is a mixture of pasta, chicken, vegetables, and salad. So when you cook with me, it's all about doing it in the least amount of time in the right chronological order. So I think about what's gonna take the longest and I'm like, okay, what's gonna take the longest? Pasta, so I start this first. I think the chicken is gonna take the longest. Not the way I cook it. Ew. While your water's boiling, you gotta season your meat. Pinch of olive oil, that's a little bit more. And I use seasoned salt, basil, and pepper. Kind of sprinkle it in there like so. Gotta sprinkle that in. Babe, do you not have any jokes about basil or salt? I take cooking very seriously. I'm not a joker on here. If you want to joke, go watch our home tour. Plug. <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna be the base of your seasoning. So you take your meat, you just kind of massage all of the olive oil. Must all you that get your hands it. that dirty? Absolutely. It's part of cooking. <laughs> okay, so Jordan is mixing the pasta right now. He added pesto and then he added these sun-dried tomatoes from Trader Joe's. So he has this like ravioli, broccoli, chicken, tomatoes, sun-dried tomatoes, pesto, and cauliflower. Marry you, this is so good. I also got another surprise. Now are you ready? What? What is that? Dessert. Sprinkles, cupcakes! Oh my gosh, these are the new fall flavors. I love you. You are a man of my heart. Mwah. 
Thank you so much for watching this video, guys. I'll put the link for Tara up down below if y'all wanna check them out. I have a promo code for 25% off if you use um, the promo code Danny. So I hope that y'all enjoy them like I do. It's so funny. It's like I actually look forward to taking my vitamins every day and I never thought I'd say that. So thank you so much to Kara for sponsoring this video and I will talk to you later. Bye. Still stun how you love that. Got the whole world asking how I does that. Hot girl, hands off, don't touch that.